so hello guys welcome back to the channel in this video we'll cover this amazing lab so simply click on start lab and just open the console incognito window now here if you get any kind of pop-up just click on i agree and agree and continue and here just click on i understand now here as i said earlier you have to click on i agree and agree and continue now from the navigation menu find the vertex here and click on workbench now here the first thing we have to do is that we have to reset the notebook so come over here and here you can see this checkbox you have to just select it and click on reset let me show you how you have to do it do it like this and here you can see clearly that the notebook is getting reset it will take some time so wait for it after that we have to open the Jupyter lab and one more important thing if you get any kind of error how we have to resolve it i'll show you in this video meanwhile if you're new to this channel do like the video and just subscribe the channel you can refresh it like this So finally here you can see the Jupyter Notebook is now ready and in working stage. Now we have to just open the Jupyter Lab. Basically click on the button which is highlighted next to the instance name. You can see here click on it. Now chances are there you may get some kind of error because sometimes it takes time to update the notebook. So here if I get any error you have to just see it as I am doing and then complete the lab here you can clearly see we are getting this kind of error so how we have to resolve this error close this window come over here and open the Jupyter lab again so this is the simple step you need to wait for some time and then try again to open the Jupyter lab now here we have to just run one file and then you will be able to complete the lab Please follow. One more important thing, make sure your internet connection is off. fully connected and does not interrupt in the middle of the lab. Now here you can see a file name intro underscore prompt underscore design is here. We have to just select that file and then you have to select Python 3 as kernel. Click on it and just select Python 3 as kernel. You can see it's still connecting. Wait for it to get idle idle means the circle which you are seeing will be blank like this basically not filled i click on this play button to run the shells one by one now here after running it we have to restart the kernel okay do not move ahead until you have restarted it you can see all these tasks are here we have to complete it now here you can see for restarting the kernel click on kernel you can see restart kernel click on restart now kernel is being restarted once the kernel is idle you can just check when the circle is just empty after that you have to again press this play button or you can just run all shells at a single way i have to do you have to click on run run selected cells and all belows now it will take three to five minutes you need to wait for it and after that you will surely done with the lab so just wait for some more time basically three to five minutes so finally here you can see the command has executed basically the task has been completed now we have to come back again to the lab instructions and check the score one by one one more important thing i wanted to share if you are not getting score here just refresh the browser window and try again and one more important thing is that for other pre-assessment skill badges the lab fake courses all the things are available on the channel do check the description box for the master sheet do like the video and subscribe the channel